Hey everyone, welcome to a super quick video. This one's going to be on how to run the old Need for Speed 2 Special Edition on your uh, Windows machine. This will work for 32-bit and 64-bit. Now, the reason I'm doing it on this one is to show you how to do it on 64-bit. This method it will uh, negate having to have the game actually installed from the disk, which is way easier. Uh, you know, than having to install it from the disk because on 64-bit machines, it's kind of hassle uh, to get it to work. So let's go ahead. If you're interested in this, go ahead and open up your browser. We're going to navigate to this page right here, and we're going to scroll down and download this file right over here. Uh, you need to click on latest first. Once you've done that, go ahead and scroll down to the bottom, and we're going to download the Win32 version 1.40 zip. So go ahead and install that or download that to your computer. Once you're done, you're literally done with the download process. You can go ahead and close that window and go ahead and, and uh, you know, make windows for where you want the game installed. So you're going to have an empty folder with the name that you want. You're going to have the window on the left side with the uh, CD mounted. You do need the physical CD or a image of it to get this to work. Now, the reason I'm showing you this way is super easy. All you're going to need from this disk is these two folders here. So copy those. We are going to paste that into the folder that's going to contain the game. Then once you've done that, we're going to go into the uh, downloads folder where you have that file. We are going to extract those files. Once that's done, we're going to go in here and take all these files from here. So control A to select all and then uh, copy the files paste that into the folder and that is literally done the process for getting the game to work should now be completed so let's go ahead and launch this make sure it is working now i recommend you use this one it will uh, work better with the modern computers so go ahead and launch that as you can see that launched without an issue and go ahead and enter the movies are working go ahead and go in here and set this up So as you can see, you have the options here to set the game set up the way you want. Location can be set there. And then the most important one, go in here for options. You can change these if you want, graphics and so forth. Click done, hit exit. Or you can also choose to go ahead and uh, get your joystick set up right here. So you can set the settings you want on here. I've already done that, so it should be working from the previous install. But on your first install, go ahead and set that up. And you can go ahead and launch that. And as you can see, that is running fine. All right. So we did a little test of that. So that is it for the video. If you guys make use of that, go ahead and give me a thumbs up. If you have any questions, post them on the comment section. And we will see you guys on the next video. Have a good one.